The Airbus A400M Atlas is easy to underestimate. At first glance, it looks like a supersized cargo plane built to haul crates, trucks, and soldiers. But its logbook hides missions that carried far more weight than boxes. The Atlas can carry up to 37 tons of cargo or 116 fully equipped troops in a single flight. Its maximum range stretches to 4,800 kilometers when fully loaded and up to 8,700 kilometers with a lighter payload, giving it unmatched reach for long distance operations. The aircraft cruises at speeds of around 780 kilometers per hour. It can operate from short or unprepared runways as short as 800 meters, making it ideal for frontline missions and remote humanitarian relief. Its cargo bay is 17.7 meters long, 4 meters wide, and 3.85 meters high. Capable of transporting armored vehicles, helicopters, or even fully equipped ambulances, it was designed to bridge a gap between heavy lifters like the C-17 and smaller tactical transports. Still, it quickly became something else entirely, a machine trusted with tasks where failure was not an option. It could move fast, land almost anywhere, and carry equipment no other plane could manage. That combination made it the perfect aircraft for the missions no one was supposed to discuss. For over a decade, governments turned to the A400M when the stakes were high and the circumstances demanded discretion. Its story is not just about what it can carry in terms of commercial transport, but also about what it carried in silence and what it carries now in missions where secrecy was as important as the payload itself. And that's where we begin, with the real question, why so much secrecy around this aircraft in the first place? Every military transport tiptoes, but the A400M takes discretion to another level. The reason is simple. The missions it flies often involve more than just logistics. They include politics, strategy, and sometimes the fine line between war and diplomacy. One reason for secrecy is operational security. It becomes a target if the world knows when and where a transport aircraft is flying. The A400M has delivered supplies, equipment, and personnel into areas where even airspace was contested. Announcing those missions would put crews and passengers in direct danger. Another reason is political sensitivity. Sometimes the Atlas moves weapons or aid into countries where governments officially deny involvement. Other times, it supports allies without drawing too much international attention. The less the public knows about those flights, the easier it is for leaders to act without sparking diplomatic fallout. Finally, there is the matter of credibility. When the A400M flies into a crisis zone or conflict, it is not just delivering cargo. It conveys that Europe and its allies can act decisively and rapidly. But those signals only work if the mission remains frozen until the job is done. This mix of danger, politics, and subtle messaging is why many of the A400M's missions never appear in headlines. It is also why, when they finally do emerge from the shadows, the story is often bigger than anyone realized. Which brings us to one of the most sensitive operations in recent years, support flights to Ukraine. When Russia's full-scale invasion of Ukraine began in 2022, much of the world focused on tanks, missiles, and artillery. But behind the headlines, quiet flights were keeping Ukraine's defenders supplied. The Airbus A400M was at the heart of that invisible supply chain. Airbus confirmed that A400M fleets were used for replenishment deliveries to Ukraine. What was delivered is still classified, but military analysts believe it included everything from medical supplies and ammunition and heavy equipment that only an aircraft of this size could carry. With a payload of 37 tons, the A400M can move armored vehicles or multiple pallets of weapons in a single trip, making it far more efficient than other transport aircraft. One of the most extraordinary episodes came early in the conflict. Two Turkish A400Ms flew into Kyiv's Borispil Airport in February 2022, just as the invasion began. The aircraft became stranded for nearly 10 months, trapped by the rapid escalation of the war. They only returned to Turkey in December 2022 after tense diplomatic negotiations, a stark reminder of the risks of these missions. Secrecy was essential. Openly advertising supply flights into Ukraine would have made them prime targets for Russian strikes. Instead, many of these missions were conducted discreetly, often at night, ensuring weapons, equipment, and aid reached Ukrainian forces without drawing attention. These support missions may never fully be revealed, but what we know already shows the aircraft's importance. While tanks and jets captured the spotlight, the A400M kept Ukraine's supply lines alive. 
and that quiet efficiency made it just as vital as any frontline weapon. The Ukraine flights proved the A400M could deliver in one of the world's most politically sensitive and military dangerous environments. That flexibility also made it invaluable in another shadowy theater, special operations across Africa. Before we move on, if you enjoy uncovering these hidden missions of the A400M, hit that like button and subscribe. It helps the channel bring you more stories from the world of military aviation. And while you're at it, drop a comment below and let us know which missions you didn't realize the A400M was involved in. Far from the European battlefields, the Airbus A400M has also been a constant presence in Africa. From Mali to the broader Sahel region, the aircraft have been a lifeline for special operations forces working in some of the harshest environments on Earth. The Sahel is vast, stretching across half a dozen countries, with little usable roads or railways. For special forces, hunting insurgents and militants, speed and surprise are everything. The A400M provides both. With the ability to land on rough dirt strips as short as 750 meters, it can deliver troops, armored vehicles, and supplies directly to remote forward operating bases in places where no other large transport aircraft can go. French forces used the A400M extensively during Operation Barkhane, a long-running counter-terrorism campaign in Mali and neighboring states. The aircraft transported troops and vehicles and carried out critical resupply missions to sustain units deployed deep in the desert. Without those deliveries, operations against jihadist groups would have stalled. The aircraft's versatility also came into play for medical evacuations. In combat zones, where helicopters could not reach, the A400M's ability to rapidly load stretchers and fly patients to advanced hospitals saved lives. Its cargo bay can be quickly converted into a flying hospital, carrying dozens of wounded personnel while medical teams work mid-flight. Perhaps the most significant contribution was its support for covert insertions and extractions. Special forces rely on aircraft that can get them in and out of hostile territory without being detected or delayed. The A400M's combination of long range, heavy lift, and rough field capability made it the perfect partner for such missions. These African missions revealed the aircraft's dual character. On the one hand, it was a workhorse, hauling vehicles and supplies across endless stretches of desert. On the other hand, it was a scalpel, enabling pinpoint special operations with precision and discretion. And this wasn't unique to Africa. The same strengths that made it indispensable in Mali would prove as valuable in other high-risk theaters, including the Middle East. When the world shut down during the COVID-19 pandemic, the A400M found itself on an entirely different kind of front line. Nations scrambled to move critically ill patients and medical supplies, and this heavy lifter was suddenly transformed into a flying hospital. In France, engineers developed the Merope system, which allowed the A400M to carry up to four patients under full intensive care conditions. Ventilators, monitors, and medical staff were loaded directly into the cargo bay, turning the military transport into a lifeline. On one mission, the French Air Force flew four COVID-19 patients from the overwhelmed hospitals in Le de France to regions with spare capacity. Meanwhile, the UK's Royal Air Force deployed its critical care air support teams on the A400M, moving patients from the remote areas like the Scottish Inlands to mainland hospitals. For communities cut off by geography, it was life-saving. At a time when fear and uncertainty gripped the globe, the aircraft designed for war was quietly saving lives. Speed and reach can mean the difference between life and death when disaster strikes. After the devastating 7.8 magnitude earthquake that hit Turkey and Syria in February 2023, the A400M became the backbone of one of the largest multinational airborne relief efforts in recent history. Up to seven customer nations joined Turkey's fleet, sending their A400Ms filled with urgently needed aid. These aircraft carried everything from ambulances and mobile hospitals to search and rescue teams, supplies that could not have reached the hardest hit regions by road. Collapsed bridges and shattered infrastructure cut off many towns, but the A400M could still get them. One of the aircraft's most critical roles was transporting heavy equipment, the kind that smaller airlifters could never carry. Entire field hospitals and emergency vehicles were flown in, giving relief workers the tools to treat survivors on the ground. Its ability to land on short or damaged runways proved vital. While other aircraft had to circle for better conditions, the A400M delivered life-saving cargo directly to regions where every minute counted. For survivors trapped under rubble or cut off from medical care, that capability meant hope arriving from the sky. Even when the A400M's missions make headlines, the aircraft's capabilities remain extraordinary. Earthquakes, floods, and other disasters have shown that the Atlas can become a lifeline, moving massive quantities of aid faster than conventional transport could. During the 2023 Turkey-Syria earthquake relief, A400Ms from multiple nations delivered ambulances, medical teams, and food supplies directly to affected areas. 
Each plane could carry up to 116 tons of cargo, equivalent to four fully loaded C-130s, reaching regions completely disconnected from road access. The aircraft's speed and precision meant critical supplies arrived before communities ran out of essentials. Every flight made a measurable difference in saving lives, from temporary shelters to emergency vehicles. Even in high-profile operations, the A400M proves its design and versatility are not just for military or covert missions. Its ability to deliver aid under challenging conditions underscores why it is considered one of the most capable airlifters of the modern era. From clandestine supply runs to international disaster relief, the A400M has quietly defined what a strategic airlifter can do. Its missions combine secrecy, technical excellence, and humanitarian impact, making it a true workhorse of the sky. After showing its impact in high-profile relief operations, the A400M's role in global missions goes even deeper. Many flights involve coordination between multiple nations, often in politically sensitive or high-stakes situations. Each mission demands precision, trust, and discretion because moving critical equipment, personnel, or humanitarian aid across borders is rarely straightforward. Its missions involve partnerships between nations, mainly when politically sensitive operations are concerned. Coordinating across borders, sharing airspace, and moving critical equipment requires trust, precision, and secrecy. For example, NATO missions often involve multiple A400Ms from different member nations working together to supply frontline units or deliver humanitarian aid. Even when the flights are publicized later, the details of what was transported, who was on board, and exactly where the aircraft landed often remain classified. Such cooperation maximizes efficiency because by pooling resources, allied nations can respond faster to crises, moving essential equipment to conflict zones, evacuating civilians, or supporting rapid humanitarian relief. Each mission becomes a demonstration of both technical capability and diplomatic coordination. The international nature of these missions adds a layer of complexity and secrecy. Every flight plan, every cargo load, and every crew assignment is carefully coordinated to ensure safety and operational success often under the radar of public scrutiny. The A400M has quietly redefined what a modern transport aircraft can do. From secret supply flights to frontline evacuations, from delivering humanitarian aid to supporting multinational operations, it has consistently proven that versatility and reliability are crucial as speed and payload. Each mission demonstrates its ability to operate where others cannot, often under extreme conditions or in politically sensitive regions. It has enabled countries to act quickly and efficiently, sometimes saving lives in ways that will never make headlines. Its presence reassures allies, strengthens logistical chains, and gives planners a powerful tool in both crisis and combat. The aircraft's unique range, payload, and adaptability combination ensures that missions get done, whether moving troops, vehicles, medical supplies, or entire relief teams. The A400M is a symbol of ingenuity, international cooperation, and quiet heroism. Its decade of service reminds us that the most significant impact often happens behind the scenes far from public view. If you enjoyed discovering the hidden side of the A400M, hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell so you'll be the first to see our next video, where we'll uncover another incredible story from the skies and reveal missions most people never knew existed.